Hi guys, Mrs. O'Neill here. Just wanted to do a quick little video to get you started on your next assignment for choir chimes. Um, there are two that you can choose from, so you just have to choose one. One involves a ukulele and the other does not. So the one that involves the ukulele, there is a link for the um, ukulele mic. He is telling how to choose which strum to use. So watch that video and he's going to go through four different strums using the song Kumbaya. And so I want you to practice those strums just on that short song Kumbaya and then make me a video that shows that you can play using those four strums, okay? And then if you choose the other assignment, the one that does not require a ukulele, that is called making a glass xylophone. So there is a video that shows how to make a glass xylophone. Now all it is is you're going to find some glasses, some drinking glasses um, in your house. You might want to check with mom first and make sure that hopefully they won't break. But you're going to fill each of them with different amounts of water and listen for the pitch to change. Now there are different ways of playing. You can tap the side lightly with something like a pencil or a spoon. Um, you can also dip your finger in the water and then rub it around the edge of the glass and that will make a sound as well. Uh, so experiment and see if you can make um, a number of pitches, a number of different sounds, musical notes, so that you can play some songs. Now, if you're really, really good and get, get them really pitched well, like in a major scale, you should be able to play some songs like maybe Joy to the World or Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, or something that uses just eight different tones if you, if you get them pitched right. Um, if not, then just make up your own song and just experiment with sound and how different amounts of water in different glasses sound different. And you might even try different size glasses um, and just see how the different sounds are. So have fun with that assignment and send me some videos so that I can see what you have created. So you guys have a wonderful day and I will talk to you really soon. We'll have our Zoom meeting on Friday and instead of optional, I would like for everyone to sign on. So that would be Friday at 1.30. So we'll touch base then. Bye guys.